Here I have HTC Uplay and let me show you how to go through the initializing setup process so how to accomplish activating this device. At the very beginning you have to start from the welcome panel. As you can see here you can choose your desired language. Here you have full list of available languages that you can use on this device. So in my case let me choose English, for instance from United States right here. You can also choose the emergency right here to make some emergency calls, if not let's go back right here, here we have some tools, you can choose for example a diagnostic tool, accessibility settings and some other stuff, let's go back, if you are ready let's choose start right here. Here you have some terms of use, you can read all this information and if you agree to all of them, let's tap next. As you can see, you can set up an internet access, you can use a mobile data, but you can also use a Wi-Fi, so let me do it, let's choose my Wi-Fi, choose connect and let's tap next. Let's don't skip right here, now the device is connected, so let's tap next right now. The phone is checking info, let's wait a few seconds. And now you can add a Google account to your device. You can also skip this point by using that key right here, but it's good to have a Google account connected to your device, so you can do more with your device. You can create a new Google account by using that link, or you can use an existing one, so let me do it that way. Let's input an email. Let's tap next. Now you have to enter your enter your password, so let me do it. Let's wait a couple of seconds. If you are ready, let's tap next right here. And if everything is alright, you have to accept terms of services and privacy policy, so let me do it by using that key right here in that corner. The device is checking in for one more time and here you have some settings of Google services and you can change them. For example, you can enable or disable automatically backup device data, use Google's locations to help apps, improve location accuracy, help improve your Android experience and in my case let me leave all of these features enabled and let's tap next. Now you can set up a payment method of your device, but you don't have to do it, you can choose no thanks and tap continue to bypass this step. Here you have some settings about time and date, let's choose next if everything is correct. You can also create or use an HTC account but you can bypass this step by choosing skip for now right here. So let me choose don't use in my case. You can protect your phone by using a fingerprint. Let me do it later, so let's choose skip for now. Let's tap skip anyway. You can personalize your phone by inputting your name. So let me do it and tap next. Here we have some popular apps that you can download already. You can also go back if you would like to skip this point. Tap next. Let me unclick these apps and choose finish. The device is finishing setup. Let's wait a few seconds. Excellent. As you can see, now you can use your device. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel and leave thumbs up under the video.